There's so much to know, so many people to meet, so much adventure awaits. What are you waiting for? Hey y'all, I'm Jamie Doris, Miss Congeniality. Join me each week as we make connections, face fears, and share love, all while being totally fabulous. There's no topic off limits, no story too bold. Together, we'll try it all. Prepare to be surprised with me, Jamie Doris. I am Miss Congeniality. Hello, y'all, and welcome to Miss Congeniality. I'm your host, Jamie Doris, and today, guess where we are? We are legit in Moscow, Russia. I kid you not, you guys. I had a girlfriend of mine who was an exchange student back in the U.S. a couple years ago. Her name is Sofia Archmanova, and she invited me to come visit. You know, my soul said yes well before my brain could catch up with all the problems that could possibly go wrong. So far, you guys, I have been loving my stay here, and I can't wait to show you more. So on today's show, we're talking Russian-American stereotypes. We're also touring the Moscow condo of a well-known Instagram influencer. And we're doing some souvenir shopping with this cool cat. Black Putin. The Black Putin. <laughs> you guys, I am so excited to show you the content of this show because you know what? Nobody else does this. Nobody else just flies by the seat of their pants and talks to anyone in the world in any language they want because they, they just want to, okay? And no one is as friendly as your girl Miss Congeniality. So anyways, that's what's going on today. But first, a word from our sponsors. are in Red Square here in Moscow and I can't wait to introduce you to my friend. Her name is Sofia Artemanovo and she is the reason I'm even here in Russia. <laughs> Sofia, welcome to the show. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Thank you so much for inviting me here to Russia. Thank you for coming. <laughs> you guys, I know like very little about Russia even though I'm excited and she told me in the airport that I just totally surprised her by coming. Yes. Well, you know, when people say, oh, I'm going to come visit, I was like, okay, we'll see. Um, but here she is. I mean, <laughs> Isn't that she hilarious? really came. I really did come. And <laughs> let me tell you what, the funny thing about coming to Russia is everybody's opinions yeah. of what Russia is back home in the U.S. Yeah. I got everybody going like, well, why are you going? And is it safe? And you better come back alive. Oh, man. And I'm like, you know, when you ask me, I keep telling people my soul said yes, but my brain right. really didn't think anything through. Why do you think people are like so freaked out about Russia? Well, um, I think it's because of the social media stuff. And I think when people think about Russia, they think about the politics, not the actual people. So. Oh, <laughs> What are the things that Russians think about Americans? Like, what are the American stereotypes? Because I think that's what we're really talking about here, are the stereotypes. Yeah, this, we watch a lot of American movies, so American TV shows, so we have this um, clear picture of American culture. And when I came, I was not surprised. I mean, of course I was surprised because it's just like a movie. We had this clear picture of American culture and so I think this is why we have a lot of information about America, but you guys don't really have a lot of information about no. Russia. So what do you think about my dress? Oh, I think it's really authentic. It is not a costume, guys. It's, <laughs> it's a dress. We bought it yesterday, literally. It took us um, maybe 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Yep. Yep, um, 10 minutes, and it cost 23,000 rubies. Do you realize how much money that is? 23,000 yeah. rubies. Yep. And it's not a costume, but it looks a lot like a uh, Russian dress, you it know, does. just traditional Russian dress. I love it so much. It looks ah, really good on you. No. This is you red know. lipstick, you know. Oh. You know what I love so much about everything I've seen so far in Russia is the fact that it's all so ornate in here. You guys love beauty and you love oh yeah, oh, yeah. like curves mm. and lights and flowers what's yeah. up with that 
I don't know. I think it's deep inside us, Russians. Yeah. And, you know, I didn't realize it before you told me that. And then I was like, oh, yeah, that's actually yeah. a thing. Yeah. They well, love flowers. Yeah, we do. And yeah, have you seen do. the architecture here? Oh, my God. Look at that. This is beautiful. <laughs> do you speak English? Okay. Hey. Hey. You speak English. I know you do. Mm. Yes. Yeah. So what are the three things that come to mind when you think of America? Mm, America is uh, burgers, Trump, and mm, Los Angeles. Uh, McDonald's, uh, then Futurama, and uh, uh, models. Uh, cinema. I want, I like movie, I like um, beach. Nice people, beauty counter. <laughs> nature, interest in nature. I like trees, uh, waterfalls, beers. <laughs> the national parks of America. Stay tuned for more Miss Congeniality. Look like a million bucks without spending it. Here at Back on the Rack, we sell only the brands that you trust. Jade, Carly, Chanel, Dolce & Gabbana, Tibby, Kate Spade, Louis Vuitton, and more. Back on the Rack, Upscale Resale. We buy and sell across the U.S. and you can shop right on Facebook. It's luxury consignment for the stylish woman. All right, y'all, and we're back. We are about to meet somebody I've never met before. Her name is Christina. And I've kind of learned in Russia it's a big deal to give flowers. So I'm going to give this lady some flowers. Y'all ready? I'm ready. Hello! Hello <laughs> I got you some oh, flowers. Oh, thank you so much. So nice of you. <laughs> thank you for letting me come and like, be in your house. Oh, welcome. <laughs> welcome to Russia. Well, thank you. Welcome Do I need to, to take Moscow. my uh, shoes off? Of course. Okay, I'll take my <laughs> shoes off. Look and you look house. amazing, actually. Oh, thank like you. Like a Russian style dress. <laughs> we found this in 10 minutes at the mall. Amazing, it's just amazing. And they only had one size, so, so I had you know, like a Russian, uh, <laughs> Russian woman. <laughs> <laughs> you need a kakoshnik, you know, this... Um, no. No? <laughs> With a takoshnik? <laughs> Kakoshnik. It's a traditional, actually, uh, woman uh, yeah. costume, a, a part of costume. Really? So you have the, you know, the dress, but you need this one. Do you have Kakoshnik. one here? You have to, no. Oh. But you have to Google and then, and then put it in your videos, Kakoshnik, mm -hmm. <laughs> just to explain what it is. <laughs> She's Russian and she doesn't have a Kakoshnik. Because, you know, we, we, we don't really wear Yeah, I know. <laughs> you guys, what I learned about this lady right here is she is an Instagram blogger, influencer chick, and she's a stylist. A stylist. And what did I miss? Anything else? Uh, a designer also. I have my own brand. You have your own brand? Uh, yes, clothes brand. What's it called? Uh, Senti. Senti. Yeah. What does that mean? Beach, uh, it's a beach cloth. Do you yeah. wear that on the beach? No, not. It's not my clothes. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> but it's you know for summer, summer, yeah. summer clothes for beach. Yeah. Where in the world did you come from? Like how did <laughs> how did I end up in your house? Look at this place. <laughs> Have you guys seen this place? <laughs> it's and amazing. Look this, yeah, look at this. Though you, it's amazing. How long have you lived here? Um, for two months actually. <gasps> That's brand new. <laughs> wow. I just moved to, to this apartment. Come on out here, you guys. <laughs> Look at this view. Wow. Just believe me, that's the best view in, uh, you know, in town. And that here. is why she lives here. <laughs> Let's go check out the rest of this place. Let's go. <laughs> so this is the place of the power. Yes, that's, that's where I actually get the, you know, the inspiration. I love cooking. And I'm so about um, healthy cooking, so. <laughs> so all healthy food. Yeah, you know, it's a goji. Goji berries, berries. yeah, I'll take one of them. Can you just eat these? Yes. 
So I, I love goji actually. Do you just eat it like this mm -hmm. or you do something with it? Mm, I can just I can use it now. Just like this Instead is why you stay so thin. <laughs> Try this one. <laughs> Ooh, it's huh? amazing. It's like granola. No. So why do you speak English so well? Um, but not that well. Uh, but I was, <laughs> I was an exchange. I used to be an exchange student, and I lived in uh, New York for a year. New so York State. New York State. Yeah, <laughs> it, it wasn't New York uh, City, and Manhattan. <laughs> it was just a little town. I would say village. It's like a tiny village. Only one school, and no restaurants, nothing. Mm -hmm. and, uh, grocery store only one. So it was crazy, but very nice people, very and very traditional Americans, you know. So that's well, why yeah. I really miss, you know, this um, um, American uh, emotions, and you know, then people are open and happy and happy. So that's that's probably the biggest uh, difference between Americans and Russians, because Russians are so you know like so strict, yeah, and so string strong. <laughs> So why do Russians not like to smile? Uh, it's hard life, I think. We may be more close uh, for another people. For, my, uh, for myself, I'm very close. We have an opinion uh, that uh, when people smile uh, without any reason for that, uh, it means they're stupid. <laughs> it's information, don't, don't about me. I smile every day. I'm very optimistic uh, human. <laughs> you, you too, I see. <laughs> I'm smiling. <laughs> but they're very nice though, if you speak to them. Like, it's not that they are not ha happy. Like, it's just, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it's your day here at Michael Vincent Salon. Whether you come in for a cut and color or a manicure and massage, we want you to feel relaxed. We are trendy, light, friendly, and downtown. Our clients become our friends. Come as you are, leave as a star. Michael Vincent Salon, Highway 49, downtown Gulfport. Uh-oh, why is this in here? You but got you know, this in the powerhouse. Yeah, room. but you know, um, I like to eat a lot but healthy mm -hmm. and then after mm. <laughs> so, so you know, something some, about this I'm not and then you just in. run and then just you know it's like okay <laughs> let's get some sport <laughs> let's get rid of it <laughs> so you eat and then you work and out run, yes and then you eat again <laughs> yeah oh my god all right we're every, going this way every morning uh, that's a few quotes one two <laughs> three four five how many coats do you own? Uh, that's only for this season. You know, we have winter, we have autumn, spring, some summer for some also. <laughs> so I think she has a lot of clothes as a, a stylist. That's look at this bathroom. <gasps> <gasps> yeah, that's another place of power, I would say. <laughs> It's like a queen. Oh, I could like sleep in this thing. Yeah. <laughs> look at this. And wow. Look and enjoy the view. <laughs> wow. You do so, have so a view cute. in your bathtub. Oh. Wow. <laughs> Christina, where did I find you? <laughs> so. Did you pick I, up I'm all happy. of the stuff yeah. in here? Yes. Yeah. And I was. It took some time, actually, around one year, I actually built this apartment. Ugh, but it looks nice now. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, I really like, you know, this black stripes all around the walls. And I'm like matching everything, so. You have silk carpet? Yes. yes. <laughs> You've got nice. to be kidding me. <laughs> it's. Looks, uh, looks and actually feels nice. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I don't know why you're wearing slippers. <laughs> wow. Oh my God. Uh, it looks yeah. like oyster shells. Yes. You ever had oysters? Actually, oysters. Yeah, yeah, I love it. But I don't really eat it in Moscow, in Russia, because we are not <clears throat> very good at, you know, seafood. But 
but actually like in France, for example, I love going to Paris and eat some oysters. Ooh. How many times mm. have you been to Paris? Oh, a lot. Actually, I, I was supposed to be now in Paris. <laughs> but Shucks! <laughs> now she's with me! <laughs> yes, but, it, but I had to cancel it because of the, you know, virus. Mm -hmm. So unfortunately, all my plans... Uh, and you're with me. Yes. Shucks. And I'm in the show. <laughs> <laughs> Can you teach me how to say friendly in Russian? Дружелюбный. Friendly, дружелюбный. Друже любный. Друже любный. Любный. Друже любный. Друже любный. Любный. Спасибо. Thank you. Uh, спасибо. <laughs> I got you. Yes. It's nice you. to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> My first Kakistanian. Mm -hmm. First ever. Thank you. Won't be the last. Mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you. you. Stay tuned for more Miss Congeniality. Let's talk about something that women don't want to talk about, and that is incontinence. We at the Woman's Clinic have a simple procedure that we can do to take care of that. We use the Fatona laser. Um, it's a simple procedure. You have tightening. You have enhanced lubrication. Um, sex isn't painful anymore and you don't have that leakage that you deal with on a daily basis. Come see us at the Women's Clinic in Gulfport. We're right by Gulfport Memorial Hospital. One more time. <laughs> All right, you guys, welcome back. We are over here with Christina in her kitchen in Moscow in this amazing apartment, and we're about to start cooking. But you know, it's gotten trendy these days. We gotta wash our hands, so oh, I'm gonna wash my hands over here. So we're doing artichoke dip. <clears throat> what else are we having for dinner? Uh, quinoa salad, this beetroot, some kale, um, and nice dressing. And would you say you're, you're vegan? Because you said I'm earlier, vegan, totally yeah. vegan, okay. Are you a model? I used to be, but now already too old. You're too <laughs> How old are you? Uh, 26. And you're too old to be a model. <laughs> yeah, not that serious. Wow. What is like the worst thing you eat? Probably protein uh, bars, something like this. <laughs> protein <laughs> no bars. No sugar, but you know, it's not very nice actually. Um, you're gonna live to be 150. <laughs> and when you're 150, you're not gonna think 26 was too old to be a model. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a big fan of protein bars, so if this is her junk food, Lord have mercy. Junk food? It's actually food? tasty, no? <laughs> For me, it's like the best dessert. I'm doomed. Oh. I will never look like her. <laughs> okay, but my actually my husband sometimes it's um pirogenea kartoshka. Have you heard about this? Have you tried something like this? Ooh, yes. What That's is that? Russian. It's a typically Russian dessert. Try and it's not it. like this. It has it's sugar in it. It's very uh unhealthy. Oh good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's compare. <laughs> That's my dessert, that's my husband's dessert. Okay, okay. let's see what so you what would like. So what is in this? Uh, cacao. Cacao, a lot of butter, yep. sugar. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's it, that's it. Mm. <laughs> so we've got beetroot, beetroot. we've got quinoa, and quinoa. then you're gonna put on your dressing that you made. Uh, yes, but we actually will mix it with the kale also. Okay. I put some salt and uh, lemon, and it just a little bit squeezed, you know, so it, get, it gets a little bit uh, softer because kale is very, like, hard. <gasps> Look how pretty. Mm -hmm. Now, does food have to be pretty? Of course. Do you do this for every meal? Try. Really? <laughs> but I eat only twice a day or once, so that's, that's not a big deal for me. Okay, so and you, <laughs> vegan, eat once a day or twice. And like this. Oh my God. You have a lot of self-discipline. 
Uh, try, try, you know, Russian woman, strong Russian woman. <laughs> With a strong discipline. <laughs> okay, that's yours. That's beautiful. <laughs> what does that say? It's a child of the universe, and here the universe is inside. <laughs> yeah, I just made it in Bali. Did you really? Yeah. You are I like my spirit animal. <laughs> Seriously, you're my spirit animal. You're like this one side of me. I have this other side of me that's not like you. And then I have this one side of me that's very much like you. So what does it say again? The child of the universe. And here the universe is inside. I love it. Yeah. Is there anything you would like to tell the audience to round out this interview that you don't feel like you got a chance to say yet? Um, come to Moscow. <laughs> <laughs> um, we are so open, we really like Americans and I'm really happy to, to see, to meet you, to, you know, to enjoy this um, American emotions and opening uh, atmosphere, so thank you so much. Thank you for coming. You just got the most special treatment ever. You got this really interesting interview, I mean we're talking totally off the cuff, <laughs> totally not scripted with this beautiful Russian lady. You got to see a very intimate side of her <laughs> life. So I hope you really appreciate that. And Thank I really you. appreciate you. Thank you so much. Ah, spasiba. Spasiba. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna tell you what. There is not one Russian that has said no to us yet. Let's, let's do this one. Hey, what's up, man? This one. Where do you think she's from? She's Italy. From Italy? Uh, как вы думаете? Может быть, Словения. Словения? Лондон? Yeah, London. Austria. Austria. Yes. Maybe Germany. From USA. America. It's obvious. <laughs> Ta da! Druja Lumi! Druja Lumi! Oh my goodness, you guys, we are back. We just left Christina's house and now we're looking for souvenirs. I have my friend Kenny over here from Africa. He calls himself the Black Putin. The Black Putin. <laughs> and look what we found. Christina was talking about a kukush. Kakushnik. Kakushnik. How does it look? Does it yeah. look good? I need this to look in the mirror. Russian, Russian traditional. Oh, look. This is for Russian traditional. <gasps> yeah, you see, it looks gorgeous, you know, with the color, you understand, man? <gasps> Oh my god, this just happened. Yes. Like it just happened. It just happened exactly, ma'am. It's because of the magic of Kenny. Oh, thank you. Kenny, I have a lot of souvenirs I need to buy today. All right, ma'am. And I have like 20 people I have to buy for. Okay. And I got like three rubles. Three rubles? <laughs> three rubles is like one, two, three, like, you know, like uh, 10 cents. Oh. Mm hmm. Uh, this costs 2400 ma'am. 2400 Yes. Dollars? Uh, in Almost. dollars. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 Divided uh, by 75. Yeah. Spoke as a dollar F. About 30. About, th about $30. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Okay, now you picked out another hat for me yeah, too. Yeah, this, this one uh, is cost 1000 which is $15. $15. Can I try that on in the mirror? Of course, ma'am. I like this too. Yeah, this is Russian traditional, okay, the military. I like this. It's good. Oh, these are these little dolls. Yeah, the little dolls, okay. You get like one, two, three inside. Okay, why are these Russian? Like, wh what's so important about... Here in Russia, a symbol of happy family. Oh. Yes. And uh, it's so also, okay, some of them have, you know, a lot of... Uh, Fairy tales on it, okay? Fairy tales? Yeah. Oh, you mean painted on? Yeah, and they painted on, you know, oh. yeah, but yeah. Or maybe you can get like, something like magnets. Ooh, this one I... costs one for 200, but if you get five, 800. Ooh, well, I'm getting five. <laughs> We're gonna get five of these, uh, right? Uh, five right. for 800, so. Yeah, okay. Ooh, cool. I like the little, what's it, cook, cook, cook? Matryoshka. Matryoshka, let's yeah. get that one. Four. Four. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this one. It's on the pink rose, and uh -oh. the glass is gonna look, see? 
No, I don't like that one. <laughs> okay. Let's get that one. I like these really flat this ones. This one? Yeah, I like the flat, flat ones. Oh, yeah, yeah. flat one, yeah. That's cool. I like that. All okay. right. So I got plenty of Ten. those. Okay. okay. Let's see. What else can we find in here? Okay. This one costs 2600 okay? Okay, I'm going to get this for my niece. She's oh. worth that. All right. Oh, lovely. <gasps> Christmas ornaments. Y'all, I love Christmas ornaments. Oh, fun. You don't celebrate Christmas? Yeah, because, you know, the Christmas here in Moscow happened to be on the on January, understanding on um, January seven. Really? Ah, uh, yeah. How much are those? Let me see, please. Okay. I'm gonna see how much it costs, please, man. Six hundred each. Six hundred each. Okay, so that is. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Let's do six of those. Six of those. So, six of those, okay, yes. So I got like this one with the green, I got this one without this hair, okay? Oh, you pick it out and you tell me which one's for me. I, I need one with blonde hair. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is really oh, this pretty. Is chocolate. Yeah, this, but look this how is pretty it yeah, is. Yeah, this one right here is Russian tradition. It's called Alyonka. Can yeah, I please. try it? You, you want to try it? Why, why not? Yeah, I got to try it before I buy it. What's your favorite? Well, my favorite is like, um, I love this. Ah, like this one I'm holding Okay, right so now. feed me. I'll tell you if it's any good, all right? All right, please. All right. Mm, do you like chocolate? Oh, well, I'm chocolate. Chocolate don't eat chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> you really don't eat chocolate? No, chocolate don't eat chocolate, but it's really not nice, huh? Mm, so nice, so tasty. Mm. I love uh, this guy. Wow, I feel like I'm in love with chocolate, believe me, but it's hardly understanding. When I see people eating it, I feel like, oh my God, I'm done. I want to eat chocolate. Now, you told me this was your favorite, and then you told me you don't eat chocolate. She got me. <laughs> <laughs> well, this one looks lovely on you, believe me, understand, you know. Yeah, you, see? you just told me you eat chocolate and don't eat chocolate, so I don't know if I trust you right now. Well, you know. Chocolate. Is it real? Uh, it's real, man. It's real yes. for fifty-eight dollars. I don't think it's real. <laughs> it's 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 too expensive to be fake and too cheap try, to be real. Try on, um, mom needs something lovely. <laughs> you need to get mom something like oh my goodness, look at how you look like oh my goodness. Well, I'm not. He is a great salesman. Damn. Yeah. Young mom, she's gonna look like a queen of mean, England. Mean and a poor force. You see how she look like? Oh my goodness. Wow, look at oh my goodness. I know. Look at oh my goodness. You see how she look like? She I know. Look like, oh she look like you understand? She come from. She, I know. Like she come from Siberia. You understand? I, you know? I'm going to Siberia. Really? Next. In fact, you guys, I think we're gonna end the show just like this. Cause I'm going to Siberia next. I'm not taking Kenny with me though, oh you guys. I'm God. so sorry. Okay. Well, you know what? Okay, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miss Congeniality. Remember to love yourself, be yourself, and let's make this world yes. a more beautiful place. Exactly. Until next time, how do you say friendly again? Druze Lubny. Oh my gosh. Until next time, I am Miss Druze Lubny. Atlichina from Roscoe with love. And what about the old man? Who, my husband? Yeah! Oh, I forgot! Oh, is he? <laughs> oh my you, God. Give me that, you're a bad wife. <laughs>